Meghan and Harry's son Prince Archie might attend King Charles' coronation. King Charles III's coronation takes place on the 6th of May. There has been much talk over the possible attendance of the Duke and Duchess of Sussex at King Charles III's coronation. With that, many are speculating whether their children, Prince Archie, 3, and 21-month-old Princess Lilibet may make a surprise appearance. Prince Harry addressed the matter of his presence in his ITV interview with Tom Brabby earlier this year. Although Lilibet may be deemed too young, it's highly likely that their son Archie might join in with the festivities at his grandfather's special milestone. The youngster, who will turn four on the day of the coronation, will be the same age as King Charles when he attended his mother, the late Queen Elizabeth II's coronation back in June 1953. Archie and Lilibet did not make any public appearances during the Platinum Jubilee celebrations last year, with Harry and Meghan only attending the national service of Thanksgiving. However, if royal watchers catch a glimpse of Prince Harry's son Archie, this will mark the three-year-old's first major role since becoming a prince. No doubt, Prince Harry and Meghan will have something special planned for their son's birthday whether they celebrate in the UK or at their Montecito abode. Last week, it was reported that the Prince and Princess of Wales' three children are all expected to take part in the procession from Westminster Abbey which will follow the King's coronation. Prince George, Princess Charlotte and Prince Louis are likely to accompany the King and Queen Consort as they leave the Abbey after the service, the Times reported. The children are expected to join their parents in a carriage behind Charles and Camilla who will travel in the Golden State coach as they return to Buckingham Palace. George will be nine, and Louis will be five while Charlotte will turn eight just for days before the coronation. George, who is second in line to the throne, and Charlotte attended their great-grandmother the Queen's state funeral at Westminster Abbey in September. Prince Louis was not present and is thought to have been considered too young to attend the service with his parents William and Kate. Prince Harry and Duchess Meghan have an impressive garden for egg hunting. Easter Sunday falls on the 9th of April this year with children the world over getting excited about finding delicious chocolate eggs. And that will surely include Prince Archie, age 3, and Princess Lilibet, 21 months. The children of Prince Harry and Duchess Meghan are lucky enough to live in a sprawling mansion in Montecito, California, with a huge garden for the all-important Easter egg hunt. We know that the Sussex family likes to celebrate Easter. As the royal couple shared footage from a previous egg hunt at their home in their recent Netflix docuseries. In the video clip, we saw Harry, Meghan and her mother Doria setting up an Easter egg hunt for Archie in their garden. Harry places a cardboard bunny in the flower bed and we also see a cute Jemima puddle duck character. The trail was laid out around their stream and beautiful flower beds in the grounds of their huge private estate. Meghan was pregnant with Lilibet at the time but she still joined in with the fun, adding markers in the soil to guide her little boy. If the Sussexes create a similar trail for their children this year, there are plenty of places to hide Easter eggs in their seven-acre garden. Archie and Lilibet's playground, complete with two slides, climbing frame, tightrope, helter-skelter, and two types of climbing wall, is a brilliant place to hide eggs, and oodles of fun for the kids too. Perhaps mum and dad will scatter some choxes in their vegetable patch for their children to find. Or maybe even in the chicken coop, named Archie's Chicken, where they can collect some real eggs at the same time. The coop is full of hens that Harry and Meghan rescued from a farm. One of the couple's most loved spots in their garden is two palm trees that connect at the bottom. Perhaps Archie and Lilibert will find some Easter eggs waiting for them by the special palms. The Duchess of Sussex's current life is very different to her childhood experience as she explained in the couple's Netflix show. Reciting a heartbreaking poem about her split living situation after her parents, Doria and Thomas, divorced. The Duchess recounted the poem word by word from memory. And it included lines such as, I want to live that nuclear life, with a happy dad and his loving wife. And, so here I sit with cat number three, life would be easy if there were two of me. In the finale episode of Meghan's Archetypes podcast, she made another childhood confession, talking about an element that was missing. At the start of the show, Meghan said, I wasn't really a science kind of girl growing up. I loved cooking, gardening, writing letters, I mean not much has changed with any of that. During my childhood, 
STEM wasn't something I ever remember people talking about, let alone STEAM. I love that is what kids, especially girls are encouraged to sink their teeth into today. As a kid in the 80s, that wasn't what I was exposed to. Thank you for watching. If you like our video, would you please help us like, share and subscribe our channel. Wish you happy to see our videos, thank you very much.